Yada Quest, a store in Cincinnati, Ohio, is a pre-release event for the latest Magic the Gathering set, Scars of Mirrodin. This is where players come to play and collect new cards that won't be put up for sale on store shelves for another two weeks. In this set, there are some highly anticipated cards. The first card, Elspeth Terrell, is a Planeswalker. She has three abilities with one that acts like a Navinral's Disc. This ability allows Elspeth Terrell to destroy all permanents except land and tokens. This is a solid card to restart a game or use as a combo, especially since her other ability makes her spawn three white creature tokens. Wormcoil Engine seems like a fun card. It's a 6-6 with Death Touch and Lifelink for six colorless mana. When it goes to the graveyard, you get a 3-3 with Death Touch and another 3-3 with Lifelink. This can be really strong because you have to kill Wormcoil Engine along with its spawns more than once, and its ability may pose as a major threat against your opponents. Mox Opal is a great Mox card because of its Metalcraft mechanic. When you control three or more artifacts, you can then use the Mox Opal to reduce one mana of any color. This should be easy to obtain since it is a Mirrodin block, but its major drawback is that Mox Opal is legendary. So players may not use it as much in Type 2, but in Type 1, it's another great addition to the Mox family. That's all for our card reviews for the new set, Scars of Mirrodin. Please stay tuned for more episodes on Magic or other card games.